Hi Soul Group, I hope you're doing well in this um, Saturday and I wanted to talk about our inner child and the inner child energy uh, and state of being itself because uh, the inner child is not something that is uh, is like a child or a memory of the child being within us it's more than that it's the energy itself that we carry as spirits and that we go that we vibrate on as spirits so when we come out of the womb of this uh, 3d third dimensional um, incubator uh, we come out of the womb and we as a baby are fully open to new experiences, new realities, new wisdom, new knowledge and like we are fully receptive and fully um, emitting of and fully expressive of the energies around us and the energy that we are producing. So um, right when we come out we start to um, produce an immense amount of energy that's why like the adults and other humans are always around you because you are the center of attention you are um, so so powerful your chakras are unlimited and the energy flow that um, that we move in this reality is um, spontaneous, it's open, it's expansive and contracting but um, without this, the boundaries that we then start to put on ourselves when we start to grow up because um, we as children would cry, would um, rebel when our parents or other uh, people would put restrictions and boundaries on us because we didn't want restrictions, and restrictions or boundaries. We wanted to fully experience and be spontaneous and uh, do our things with the intuition that would um, be so loud, right? And adults would not understand this because they would uh, many of the adults right now forgot and uh, put have put their inner child in a chamber in a containment so there is protection because many times you put your inner child energy in a container you put your inner child energy in a vault because it was hurt in some senses it was it has experienced traumas that have gave have gave the the child uh, the person the spirit uh, the the need to contain that energy because in this lower dimension um, the the pain is strong you know the trauma may last for years and for decades you know so that's why it's so important to do the shadow work right now and always so the inner child can continue expressing itself by coming out and giving the energy that it wants to give so the intuition can always be the support for our journey, our inner most, our inner vision, right? So that is the inner child, basically. Um, uh, I don't. Uh, well, it it was just a quick video, so yeah. I hope you're doing well, family. And if you have any questions or something, you can ask me, and I make another video. And uh, bye.